Hey everybody, it's uh, not Blue Drake here. Now, why am I name checking Blue Drake? Well, over on his website, he has just released a copy of Smod Tactical 1.0. Now, that's a sub mod for Smod. If you don't know what Smod is, think Brutal Doom, but in a Half Life 2 universe. So, you get loads of extra guns and a load of extra blood and guts, amongst other things. Now, this idea has just been taken one step further with Tactical, and it's like Half Life 2 have had an illegitimate baby with CS Source. So, what do you need to do to install it? Well, there's a couple of things you need to download first. You need to come over to ModDB and grab yourself a copy of the standalone version of Smod. Okay, and once you've done that, come over to Blue Drake's site. Okay, over to, was it, Drakeling Labs. Download the submod. Okay, once you've grabbed both of those files, come over to Steam. Okay, so from Steam, you need to install the following three things. Counter-Strike Source. Half-Life 2 and the 2006 Source SDK. So to find the Source SDK, make sure you've got a search on in Tools. Okay, so you've clicked off Tools as well as Games. And then just do SDK. It should be here. There you go. That's the one we want. Source SDK based 2006. So install that. Okay. Once all of those are installed, we now do the following, and hopefully in the meantime, we've downloaded those other files that we needed. I'm going to come back, and in fact, I'm just going to do this. I'm going to go right-click on Half-Life, go to Properties, okay, go to Local Files. You can do this by just going through Windows Explorer, but while I'm here, I might as well do this. So, Local Files, Browse Local Files, okay, we'll get this. Then I'm going to go up. Common Steam Apps. So we're in Steam Apps. Now what I'm looking for is source mods. So what you want to do is you want to unzip the main um, standalone here, basically. So who we have. Smod standalone. Unzip the whole thing into this folder. And once that's done, drill down, okay? And under mods, that's where you would put Blue Drake's T Smod Tactical 1.0. Unzip that here. So as you can see, that's where Smod Tactical is. Right, so to launch it, do the following. Just double click on Smod Standalone. Or Standalone, I think that's been misspelled. Just leave it, it should work. Okay, there's a Smod Launcher, and as you can see, we've got Smod Tactical. Click on that. Okay. All right, so here we are at the main sort of menu screen. Now, if you want to change any of the settings, just go around clicking on these. You'll see the options are changing. Just keep clicking them, keep an eye on them. So if we want, like, say, for example, blood gore, what is it? That is medium, high, blood and guts, whatever. Okay, so there's that. So do you want to play a new game? Yes, please. Do this. Okay, and then you can just scroll along. Here's, like, some saves, I think, from earlier from my Half-Life 2 game. But just scroll along. And here we see the various scenarios from CSGO. Okay, so if I just click on one just to show you it. We'll just wait. There we go. There's some dudes. There's a load of guns. Kill him. Oh, kill him, kill your mates. <laughs> He's turned traitor. All right, just in case you do have any problems with this though, okay, which I did actually the first time I installed it, I couldn't get any of the CSGO maps to come up. You can do the following. Fire up the console by hitting the tilde key. Okay, and now you can do change map. I think it is, change level, sorry. Okay, so it's like that. Change level. Yep, and then put in CS, whatever, down arrow. Yep, down our app row, and choose the maps that way. Okay, you can see they're all kind of there. And I'll just choose that one. And it will load. So that's just a workaround if maps are missing from the menu at the beginning of the game. 
And of course, don't forget, if you want, you can just play through the normal campaign, but with just extra blood and guts everywhere. Right, so I hope you found the video quite straightforward and easy to understand. If you've got any questions, put them in the comments section down below. And I guess all that remains is to say a big shout out and thanks to Blue Drake and the original modders for making this kind of stuff available to us. Right, I'm off to cap some combine fools. Don't forget, likes and subs, always appreciated, never required. Look after yourselves, remember to wash those hands, and I will see you next time. But until then, this is Hipkel, signing off.